Hello and welcome to the world of Craig. Yes, that's me, I'm Craig, and this is my channel where I'm gonna try extra specially hard not to do a super long intro. About four months ago, the lovely peeps of Current Body gave me this, which is their hair restoration device. I have been using it for the last, actually now it's probably more like 20 weeks that I've been using this for, and I have some findings that I want to share with all of you. So as I've just mentioned, a few months ago, the lovely peeps at Current Body, who I will link below in the description box, gave me this device and they gave it to me as a gift. There was no obligation, this video is not sponsored, no obligation to create content around this, but as a hair professional, yeah, that's me, I'm a hairstylist, among other things, wanted me to test this out and see what sort of results I would get. There is a video that's, uh, that's an overview of this fantastic piece of kit. It is, in my opinion, a beautifully made and designed and researched. I did a lot of research into this as well over the last 16 weeks and before I made, last 20 weeks it is about now, and before I made the first video, loads of research. I already use Current Body's LED face mask. There's a video about this here on my channel, which of course, as a creator, I will link down below. And the video, the overview video for this, which I'm sure that the thumbnail would be popping up on the screen here somewhere. But I have basically been using this. And I think it's worth mentioning here, just going over again at the very beginning, that I have used this every single day with the exception of about seven days. So for the last 18 weeks or so, that period of time that I've been using this, since I made the last video, I have been using it very consistently. I have been away for work a few times, so I, I couldn't take this with me. I wanted to take it with me. I did take my LED face mask with me, but I didn't take this as well. So, but I have been using this consistently, okay? Now, I think the easiest way to do this, I have been documenting my progress with the help of my lovely friend Russell in the salon. I have been documenting my progress. So let's have a look at some befores and afters and my own personal findings. And the, the, the helmet, oh. So thinking about it, there will be people that might not want to watch the overview video. So very briefly, what exactly does the hair restoration device do? Well, it uses low level light therapy. The light that you can see here, this red light, to stimulate the growth from the follicle, which is where the hair comes from, okay? But not only does it do that, it helps to promote great scalp health and circulation. So it's an all round treatment for both the improvement of hair and the retention of hair. The low level light has, there are um, statistics to show that it can help you retain the hair that you have as, which is one of the things I was kind of interested in this for, as well as promoting new growth and thickness. As I said, I will link the overview video down below, but not everybody will want to sit and watch that. So, and I will link, as I said, I'll link this down below too, so you can check out what Current Body has to say about this fantastic device. And it has been researched. They do have some figures on their website and there's lots and lots of information. And as always, if you find this video helpful with its information, you know what to do. And if you would like to have a look at my hair day today, there's loads of formulas, there's some um, lots of reels obviously on Instagram. I will link all of that down below. It is packed full of hair information and what I get up to in my day to day. Right, let's get on to the good stuff with those befores, afters, results, and findings. Now this is where I get slightly vulnerable and kind of let myself bear, if you like, because I am not self-conscious about my hair loss, but I am somebody who, I just don't really, I don't really think about it, to be honest. I started to lose my hair <clears throat> when I was in my late teens, when I was really, really young. And there's a, a massive history of male pattern baldness in my family. I am the only guy over the age of like 40 with, with pretty much any hair. I have a younger brother who has lost most of his hair on the top of his head. But I just want to kind of give a caveat here and just to tell everybody that's watching this, hello, just to tell every, all of you that are watching this that I do take a medication for hair retention. And I have taken that for a long time. I've taken it for 25 years. It's called Propecia. And it's the drug in that is a drug called Finasteride. 
if you are watching this and you are a man and you are very conscious of hair loss, then I would suggest that you have a Google, do your research, talk to your doctor, talk to whoever it is that you need to talk to, to find the right advice to see if finasteride and Propecia are right for you. It is a drug that has worked for me, but because I've been taking it for such a long time, I was part of a clinical trial 25 years ago, because I've been taking it for such a long time, it doesn't have an impact on the hair restoration device, if that makes sense. I don't use any other topical um, treatments on my scalp. There are There is a treatment called Rogaine, which uses minoxidil, Regain Rogaine, which uses minoxidil, which is another form of clinically proven hair restoration treatment. Those two things, Propecia and Finasteride, as far as I know, they are really the only two, um, sorry, Propecia and Minoxidil, Finasteride and Minoxidil, they are the only two things that are proven to help you retain your hair or help hair uh, grow through, new hair grow through, make your hair thicker as far as medications go, okay? The hair retention device is something completely different, but I wanted to tell you that because I have to be completely transparent. So on the screen here, I'm going to pop a before video of my hair, okay? So this was taken about 18 weeks ago, 18, 19 weeks ago. And then here, I'm going to pop a video that was taken last week, okay? These were taken by my lovely colleague in the salon. Thank you, Russell. So this is the before video, and this is the after video. So I'm just gonna let those run through, and then I'm gonna pop up on the screen, because this is a lot of information, and I wanna get this across in a way that's fair, and in a way that people can understand, and then they can take it away and make it their own. Because I know that hair loss, and the restoration of hair, and getting thicker hair or longer hair is very important to a lot of people. I'd just like to reiterate that this video is not sponsored. So you've seen those videos, and now here I'm gonna put a before and after picture. I'm not sure which ones I'll insert, but there'll be an angle of a picture here, okay? One of before and after here. Get your words out, Craig. Now, let's talk about my own personal findings. Yes, let's. Am I being quite serious? Maybe I am for me. I just feel that I really want to get all of the right information across and I don't want to don't want anyone to feel that I'm you know not being genuine or I'm not being authentic so let's put those pictures on the screen again here and I apologize if I look a little bit tired I have been working extremely hard at the moment and I was working on something very exciting till very late last night before filming this and, and I am really really tired but I wanted to film this because it's the right time to do it and I've got a snazzy shirt to wear this is the nearest to anything red that I have to put on. Obviously, the low-level light therapy, which is red, a very bright orange shirt, which is nearly red. Anyway, so my own findings. How have I found using the device? Well, and the results that I've had. First of all, it's really easy to use. I put it on for 10 minutes a day whilst I'm brushing my teeth or I'm rubbing cream into my feet. Yes, I do that every day. I have to do that every day. I stand up so much or whilst I'm watching a bit of television or having a snack. It's really, really simple. So that's not, and it hasn't been an issue for me at all. And it's very comfortable to wear and it's very easy to charge. All of that stuff is in the overview video. Have I seen a huge difference in the pictures that are there on the screen for you to see yourself? No, I haven't. Do I think that as a 50 year old, nearly 51, 51 year old man, that I'm going to see a huge difference from a device um, like that, like this. I don't think, I don't think you, you know, I don't think it's about miraculous results. I think it's very important that you're consistent with it. And I think it's also very important that you have, that you manage your own expectations. And, you know, I didn't expect to see a, like a full head of hair. How, do I think I've seen some results? Yes, I do. I think, you know, what's happened for me personally is that the actual, it appears that the diameter of the hair is actually getting slightly thicker. So the hair that's come through over that course of time has become slightly thicker, slightly denser in texture and slightly less fluffy. What is interesting is I do take a lot of photographs of myself. And what is interesting is that in certain lights, prior to using the device, 
I could see the line of the top of my head of my actual scalp reflecting in those images. Whereas now when I take a selfie, I don't actually see that reflection. I don't see the shape of my scalp. And personally, I think that's because I do have very fine, um, slightly fluffy new hair growth. It is very, very fine what's coming through. I don't think, and you can make your own decision from the photographs, I don't think I've seen a huge improvement on the crown of my head, but that was one of the first places that I lost my hair before my, my hairline started to recede. So, you know, and very interestingly, just recently, I've had a few of my friends who are hairdressers who have, and this is really interesting, who've looked at my stories on Instagram and who've seen me in person as well and have said, your hair looks slightly thicker. Have you got anything in it? Have you got product in it? And the only product I use in my hair is a bit of K18 leave-in mask when I shampoo my hair. But I don't even use um, thickening shampoos. I've used the detox shampoo from K18. So, and there's no gel or hairspray or anything else in my hair. So I think the results, I have seen results. I think they're very, very subtle. Am I going to continue using the device? Yes, I am. I'm very grateful that the peeps at Current Body gifted it to me. I think it's a lovely piece of kit to use. It's a very simple thing to slot into your routine. And let's see, I think again, because I am slightly older, slightly older, I love the way that I say slightly older, because I am older than some people that might use it, say, if you're 30. Do I think it could be helpful if, you, if you're not a man and you want your hair to be, to, you know, to be slightly denser or to grow slightly longer? Yes, I do. I, but I think that it is about managing your expectations and I think it's about being realistic about the sort of results that you can get. Hello, it's me, Craig from the future, or should that be Cali Spera? Yes, I am in the future and I'm actually on holiday in Cyprus and that's what we say here in Cyprus in the evening, Cali Spera. But why am I coming to you from the future? Well, about 10 days ago, one of my colleagues bleached out my hair. Oh yes, yeah, sorry, that's the other end, an elephant in the room. He's blonde again. And I've been on holiday in the sunshine, in a cap and SPF obviously when I'm in direct sun, but I have been taking some photographs of myself perhaps for social media and I've noticed even more as I mentioned previously in this video that the shadow on my scalp is even less. So the process of going blonde and taking some more photographs of myself has made me realise that my hair actually is thicker albeit very very fine, very very fine hair but enough fine hair to take away the shine if you like, the reflection on my scalp. So yeah, I mean, I'm made up about that. And it's very interesting that the process of going blonde and then taking a few more pictures of myself has made me realise that. So I'm going to go and have dinner now. Cali Spera again. And I'll, you can get back to the video. So that's it for my hair restoration device results video. Really important for me that I got this video out there. I wanted to share with all of you. I did get quite a lot of comments and a lot of DMs on Instagram when I posted the first video, when I uploaded the first video on here. So if you have got to the end of the video, thank you very much. I much appreciate that. I hope that all of you are well and just remember that if you do leave me a comment here on YouTube, I will always reply to all the lovely comments, obviously. We love lovely comments here on The World of Craig. Yes, that's me, I'm Craig. And once again, you can check out my Instagram and you know what to do if you have enjoyed this video or found it helpful, all of that as well. That's it for this time round. I will see you all in the next one.